hello everyone so let's start a new lab session of Microsoft Excel so in the last video or in the last lab we have seen that uh, how to open a Microsoft Excel application now in this lab let's see let's have some content in a Microsoft Excel document and save it so let's start to open Microsoft Excel you can simply write here Excel press enter it is open now now click on black workbook now here let me write something here let's say welcome welcome to excel world okay this is the statement you have written now if you want to save this excel in a particular location or in a particular folder you have to go to the file you see this is the file now there are two options are available that is save and save as so what is the difference between these two we'll see one by one so let's start with the save as so the moment you press save as it will be asked or it will ask for the location or the folder where you want to save this file so when I click here it is asking for the location by default few locations are there now let me save in the desktop so click here or you want to save some in some other location you can simply click on browse you click on browse if you want to save in C drive you see your location is C drive and you can write anything here so for your convenient uh, let me save in the desktop over on the desktop so click on desktop you see your location is desktop now give a name to it let's say my first excel file now click on save the moment you click on save and you click and you close it this file will be saved or it is saved already on the desktop you see uh, it is not visible because I have hidden this desktop icons so the moment I turn it on it will be shown you see go to view and show desktop icon it is appearing here you see this is your first excel file okay now if I'm writing another statement that is this is my second it's a second line okay now again if i click on save as you see it will be asking for another location to save let's say if i simply s click on desktop again and if i write here this is my second excel file and click on save you see there are two files are appearing so the first file is containing my first statement and the second file is having two statements okay so let me open my second file now if I'm writing here again this is my third line and the moment I press save it will be it will not ask for a location to save in a new file the moment you click on save this particular content will be saved in this file itself it will not ask for another folder or another location to save in a new name so if you want to save the same content if you want to save the content in a same file you can simply click save you see it is not asking for any other file name or location and when I close it if I click here you can simply see that this third line is saved in this second file and in the first file still we have the first line only 